What up, family? Welcome to your card of the day. I am La Santera. Today is Wednesday, November 27th, 2019. Let's go with the Priestess of Wands. Priestess of Wands. Te traigo fuego. The Queen of Wands. This is the Queen of Wands in, um, in uh, the tarot deck. And so... This message is full of fire, right? So the elements of fire. In the book it says that, where am I? The priestess is water and fire. You're a channel. A channel, a magician who contains and disperses energy. So you know how to hold a space, you know how to hold energy, and you know how to release it. Right now you're full of energy, you're moving, you're constant moving, you're really fast paced. So we need to be very careful because there's a lot of, it says that you're a brilliant multitasker. You can do a lot of shit at the same time, but it's also warning you be careful because you can drop everything and we're being mindful of not being a hot mess. We're being mindful of our temper. We have, this is very much connected to my fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So if you have that in your natal chart, we're being mindful of that. How we're moving with this this week, how we're using this priestess of wands energy. We're being careful not to be forgetful. We are making lists. We're ordering our day. We're ordering our lives. We're organizing, right? The, the, the characteristics of this Priestess of Wands, this um, Queen of Wands, is someone who's confident, intelligent, wise, handles her handle or handles their handle. Because while I'm using, you know, gender um, terms, know that I'm gender neutral. So I believe that we all walk with this feminine masculine energy. So... How will you channel and harness this energy? How will you move? Like right now, there's a lot, there are a lot of things that you want to do. This is a wonderful weekend, right? This Thanksgiving weekend, while many of us don't celebrate Thanksgiving, I do believe in celebrating like Friendsgiving and gratitude giving and not in the way that it's practiced in this country, but just in that I like to slow it down and really look at what I'm doing. We're at the end of November. We're approaching the last month of the year, the last month of 2019, the last month of a decade. We are starting a new decade. And so we're taking this energy that's building up inside of us, this thing, this ball of fire that we're feeling. And we're allowing the water to kind of move through us so that we can move and flow, right? We're keeping it together. We're holding it down. We're saying yes to a lot of things, but we're being realistic. I always on the prize, right? Yeah, that's our card. That's our message. I like this idea of being a magician. So a lot of us are, ca are really tapping into our magic in powerful ways. We're really connecting spiritually. We're beginning to see a lot of things manifesting in our life. We're moving at a fast, so right now, time is moving very fast. 2019 has flown by. And so hold that energy, allow it to feed you, fill you, and then we can be explosive. We're just gonna be very careful about what that explosiveness looks like, right? Let's put it into our creativity. A lot of folks have been asking me about the write the fucking story challenge. And I'm really thinking about um, what that looks like and when we can write together. And so I'm gonna meditate on that and let you know tomorrow. I'm thinking that it's going to be um, one hour. My spirit is saying, make it from 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. so that I can wake up and get ready for my day because I have to leave at 7 to go to work. And many of us work. So I'm thinking we're going to start the Write the Fucking Story channel challenge one hour a day for 31 days for the entire month of December. That includes Christmas, 
that in you, includes New Year's Eve. Just so you know, there are no days off. And so, yeah, I think we just decided it. Write the fucking story challenge is happening starting December 1st, 6 a.m. sharp, 6 to 7. And scene. Family, let me know how this message today resonates with you, how the Priestess of Wands is showing up for you, this energy um, that you're harnessing, what you're seeing. Are you forgetting things? Are you filled with chaos right now? Um, is life a hot mess? Are you managing things right now? What are some things that are, what are what's rising for you? What's coming up for you? How does this feel true for you? And if you'd like a reading, hit me up, lasantera.nyc at gmail.com. Peace.